Hello and welcome to TechBoost. Today, I'm going to show you how to install hard drives and solid state drives into a Lenovo ThinkStation P920. Before beginning, we recommend checking with the manufacturer to make sure the latest firmware is installed. For this installation, you may need a small Phillips head screwdriver. The P920 can support a wide variety of drives including SATA, SAS, and M.2 NVMe SSDs. The system can support up to 60 terabytes of total storage across 20 drives using a wide variety of configurations. To begin, ensure your computer is powered off and the power cord is unplugged. Next, press and hold the power button until the light is completely shut off to ensure there is no residual power remaining on the motherboard. To access the drive bays, you will first have to remove the side panel. The main 3.5 inch hard drive bays are located at the front of the system. Remove the tray from the system by depressing the latch and pulling it out. Place the hard drive in the tray like so and ensure each of the four pins finds their way to the retaining holes on the sides of the hard drive. Once properly mounted, the hard drive will be flush with the tray and you can plug the drive into the drive bay. The data and power connections are built into the hard drive bay so you do not need to worry about connecting any cables. If you are installing a 2.5 inch drive, the process is the same, but you will have to use the smaller set of pins located at the back of the drive bay. To install an NVMe drive, you will either need a PCIe adapter or one of the drive carriers seen here. To begin, turn the red knob to release the heatsink from the carrier. Next, use a small screwdriver to remove the bracket. Place the drive into the bracket and screw it into place. Next, replace the heatsink. Locate the NVMe slots on the motherboard and lift the latch above it. Slide the drive carrier in and push the latch down to secure it in place. Lastly, reattach the side panel. Please check out our how-to videos covering processor, RAM, hard drive, and video card installations, as well as general product overviews for this and other systems. If you have found this helpful, please hit the like and subscribe buttons below. We welcome suggestions on how to make these more useful, so please don't be shy requesting more content.